German Aging Survey, Wikipedia Audio The German Aging Survey is a main source of information about aging and old age as a stage of life in Germany. It is a nationally representative, cross-sectional and longitudinal survey of people in the second half of life. The comprehensive study of people in their mid- and older adulthood provides individual data for use both in social and behavioral scientific research and in reporting on social developments. The data is thus a source of information for political decision-makers, the general public and for scientific research. The DS allows to form a comprehensive picture of life situations and life contexts of old and aging people in Germany and to respond to current political and academic questions. The German Aging Survey is funded by the Federal Ministry for Family Affairs, Senior Citizens, Women and Youth. The first survey wave was conducted in 1996. It was designed and carried out by the Research Group on Aging and the Life course from the Freie Universität Berlin, the Research Group on Psychogerontology of the University of Nijmegen and Infas Institute for Applied Social Sciences, Bonn. From 2000 onwards, the German Center of Gerontology was responsible for the implementation and further development of the project. The second survey wave of DS followed in 2002, the third was conducted in 2008, the fourth was conducted in 2011, the fifth was conducted in 2014 and the sixth wave was conducted in 2017. The data assessments are furthermore carried out by INFA's Institute for Applied Social Sciences. Starting from 2008, the DS panel is conducted every three years. A new cross-sectional sample is drawn every six years. This approach enables the investigation of social change as well as individual development over a 21-year span. A book containing the key findings of the fifth wave was published in 2016. Various other papers are published in scientific journals. Covering a broad spectrum of topics, the DS reflects the complex life situations and life concepts of the German population in the second half of life. The survey's interdisciplinary conception allows for the linking of gerontological, sociological, psychological, sociopolitical, nursing science, and economic issues. In every new wave the questions aim to balance actuality and continuity. On the one hand, adaptation of the questionnaire to accommodate new insights makes it possible to respond promptly to urgent political and academic questions. On the other hand, the retention of a sizable number of questions from the previous waves ensures comparability and the monitoring of long-term developments. The following topics are examined. Funding, History and Structure of the Study This broad spectrum of topics makes it necessary to examine them as a whole and to analyze their interrelationship and interactions during the life course. Some examples for this are issues relating to quality of life in old age and social inequality. The German Aging Survey enables analyses of cohort differences, i.e. a comparison of individuals of the same age at different points in time and thus an examination of social change. Moreover, it allows longitudinal analyses, i.e. the comparison of information at certain points in time and hence a study of individual developments over time. The DS makes possible a comprehensive description of life situations and life contexts of the German population aged over 40 in the year 2014, an analysis of social changes over the points in time 1996, 2002, 2008 and 2014 and an investigation of intra-individual development over either 6, 12, 15. 18 years or 21 years. 
Another perspective results from the comparison of individual development over a six-year period in the three time frames 1996 to 2002, 2002 to 2008 or 2008 to 2014, i.e. a comparison between the development of two or three birth cohorts in a specific age segment. Employment and Retirement generations, family, and social networks, activities outside employment and volunteer work, housing situation and mobility, economic situation and economic behavior, quality of life and subjective well-being, health and health behavior, need of assistance and need of care, attitudes, norms, values, and images of age and aging. The following samples are available from the survey waves conducted between 1996 and 2014. Wave I Wave 2 Wave 3 Wave 4 Base sample 1996 Disproportionably stratified population register sampling according to age sex and geographical location of the German population living in private households in the birth cohorts 1911-1956. Wave V The sixth wave was conducted in 2017. Panel sample 1996 to 2002 of the participants surveyed again in 2002 from B1996, base sample 2002 analogous to B1996 of the birth cohorts 1917 to 1962 in the same local districts as wave 1, sampling of non-German nationals 2002. Random sampling of non-German nationals in the birth cohorts 1917-1962 living in private households in the same local districts as Wave 1. Main Research Areas Wave 6 The findings of the German Aging Survey are published in edited volumes, refereed journals, and press informations. Press information is free of charge and available online at, where you will also find a list of selected DS publications in English. The Research Data Center of the German Center of Gerontology now also provides anonymized data sets for research purposes and advises researchers on its use. Sampling Findings Panel Sample 1996-2002-2008, participants from B1996 were interviewed for a third time, Panel Sample, participants from B1996 were interviewed for a third time, Base Sample 2008, furthermore, a new cross-sectional sample of 40 to 85-year-old persons. Literature Starting from 2008, the DS panel is conducted every three years. Therefore, the 2011 survey considered panel participants only. All of these 4,854 respondents have already taken part in at least one earlier wave. 1,039 panel participants entered the DS in 1996, 957 persons were recruited in 2002, and the majority of 2,858 participants were interviewed for the first time in 2008. Panel Sample 1996-2002-2008-2011-2014 Participants from B1996 were interviewed for a fifth time, Panel Sample 2002-2088-2011-2014, Participants from B2002 were interviewed for a fourth time, Panel Sample 2008-2011-2014. Participants from B2008 were interviewed for a third time. Base Sample 2014, a new cross-sectional sample of 40 to 85-year-old persons.
Panel Sample 1996-2002-2008-2011-2014-2017 Participants from B1996 will be interviewed for a sixth time. Panel Sample 2002-2008-2011-2014-2017 Participants from B2002 will be interviewed for a fifth time. Panel Sample 2008-2011-2014-2017 Participants from B2008 will be interviewed for a fourth time. Panel Sample 2014-2017 Participants from B2014 will be interviewed for a second time.